It's been two months since the primary and runoff elections in June. But despite time passed, several Richland County poll workers say they're still without pay, which is why a special meeting was called to order amid extreme employee changes at the Board of Voter Registration and Elections. This meeting is not a trial. It's not a hearing. It's not going to be a lynch mob. This was the meeting called in response to Director Alexandria Stevens' resignation in the wake of extended delay in payment for poll workers. And that's something, unfortunately, we didn't get done. Um, we actually had to bring somebody back in that retired to get that work done for us. Terry and Graham is right the deputy turned interim meeting. director for the Board of Voter Registration and Elections. No one in the office at this moment could run that office. He admitted to negligence and announced his resignation along with the precinct coordinator, marking three resignations in two weeks' time amid no explanation for delayed payment. Is it fair to say that the director resigned on the 29th, the precinct coordinator resigned on the 29th, and you're resigning on September 5th? Are those the three top positions in that office? Uh, that'll be, yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's concerning. The delegation did go into executive session, where Graham agreed to stay on as the interim director until next year. Chairman Leon Howard on the topic of delayed payment. When I confirmed that and found out it was true, it was very disturbing. And um, I you know, sent press release out to you guys and got involved immediately. My understanding from staff that most people have been paid, if not everyone, uh, and that um, if no one's been paid, I'd like to personally know about it. Chairman Howard says that everyone who has not been paid will receive a check or direct deposit this Friday. But if you don't receive yours, he's imploring you to contact his office. Reporting from the State House, I'm Andrew Fancher, BYS News 10.